Man has been looking at random in the world of the mind, the world of the spirit, the physical universe for a very, very long time. We didn't have time to look at random. We had a much better possible route, and that was the route of bringing people up to a point where they could look. Do you see that? And that, of course, would be the final breakout against authoritarianism. The final breakout would be to put a man in a position where he could observe Authoritarianism, arbitraries, are only accepted so long as no one is permitted to look, or so long as no one can look. And after you've been told not to look long enough and often enough, you get to where you can't look. So our route was the accomplishment of an observation platform from which a man could observe and from these observations make up his own mind. And that observation platform is what we call clear. I don't believe that the mystic ever produced a clear. I do not believe that the state of Bodhi existed in more than one man. I do not believe that createdness of a point of observation was ever done before. I really think we're brand new. To agree with people, populists, and so forth, we could go on and call this a state of Bodhi. We could call it almost anything. But the truth of the matter is, I think we have something that is brand new in this universe, which is a total freedom to observe and to play a game. Total freedom to observe might be worthwhile all by itself, but the Asiatic taught me that if he observed totally, he did nothing about it. So therefore, I do not think he observed. Watching a clear in action, I find him perfectly able to undertake action. Therefore, because I can test the state, because I know it clearly, because we have great certainty on it, we now know more about it than the men who were teaching it. That is for sure because we have the object itself that we can inspect, and that is very important. But more important than that, we can become, without dedicating several generations to a monastery, capable of observation ourselves. So therefore, I believe we have attained the first major breakthrough man has gotten in this universe for a very, very long while.